we've been searching for travel adventures that aren't on the other side of the world. And what really matters to us is to find those raw travel experiences that we've been craving for. So we boarded a 7 hour train ride from Rotterdam the Netherlands to Bordeaux in France. And in this video you'll see our first two weeks of that trip. In France. France, guys. We're starting our trip here at the Atlantic coast in Ile del Rey. Yeah, and this is a island just off the coast, and we got here by the bridge. <laughs> um, and this island is known for its picturesque villages and beautiful beaches, which we're gonna explore for the next two days. And since we loved vlogging for you guys in the last few months, we upgraded our gear. <laughs> so we have an extra camera now to film even more for so you guys. We have two angles now. <laughs> two angles and now. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> So I feel like a real vlogger now. exploring the cute streets of Arches de Ré. Yeah, and this afternoon we had a full tour of the island by both a tuk-tuk, an -tuk, electric tuk-tuk <laughs> yeah. and an uh, electric bike. It went through all of the beautiful nature reserves. Yeah, through the marshes and yeah, we've seen so much already of the island in just half a day. And also a good thing to know is that when you arrive on this island you need to pass a bridge and that bridge is in high season um, 16, 16 euros, euros which is quite a lot yeah but 60 percent of that is going back to nature preservation, preservation. <laughs> hannah hannah do you know what time it is what do you mean it's 10 a.m it's time for wine On the island is supping. We are on a inflatable sup and now we're just like slowly floating along the marshes and uh, we're gonna taste uh, the plants here that are on the side because apparently you can eat a lot of the plants. Last morning here on the island and we can't leave this island without seeing an oyster farm. And what do you think about my boot snake? <laughs> Pull up the, 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 the pants and show them. Wow! Oh my god! I know. <laughs> <laughs> After two great days on the island, we've headed back to the mainland and visited the city of sailing, La Rochelle, which is only 15 minutes away from Ile de Ré. Followed 
by a stroll on the market in Rochefort to get some snacks for our next island trip. So we're about to take the boat to Eel Dex, which is That's the island it. there. <laughs> and the island can only be explored by foot or uh, by bike. So we're gonna take the bike <laughs> yeah. there uh, because it's like seven kilometers uh, to explore everything. So there are, as far as we know, no cars. And people said to us that it's a must see when you're on this uh, side of the Atlantic coast. So um, here we go. go. Today we spent our day in Aureterre, which is one of the most beautiful, official of beautiful villages here in France. And I think you can see why, why? behind <laughs> us here with the sun setting. This is not the only beautiful thing the village has to offer. There is a underground church, a church which is cut out of the rock and you can enter that and there are staircases. It's so impressive to walk around there. When we were there, there was almost nobody else. So we had the whole place to ourselves, which was really special. And in the village, there are only living 400 people. So you can imagine how small the, uh, the village is. But although it's that small, you will find hidden gems around each corner with beautiful flowers. It's Restaurants, just... cafes, uh, we've passed some that we can't eat today, which is very unfortunate. <laughs> uh, so we wish we spent much longer here. So we would really recommend adding this place to your bucket list or at least to your road trip to France because it's really worth it. And tonight we're staying in a really special accommodation because we're staying in a nomad tent. Wow. <laughs> so let me give you a tour. So not only the accommodation itself, like a tent is special, but they decorated it so beautiful. And the place of the property is amazing. They just opened up for today for these tents. They are all around here and even a glass dome, I would say. Is it a glass or yeah, I think or it's a plastic maybe, dome. Maybe it's plastic, but yeah. still you, you can see the stars in the middle of the night. They have two guest rooms as well. And especially if you look at the surroundings here. And they have dogs. They have dogs. Yeah. Yes, <laughs> but they're not here now. <laughs> He's there. There he is. So maybe you guys didn't know this, but we are big, big dog lovers. So sorry if we mention dogs too much, but <laughs> it's just a big love, you know. Is there even a better way to see the Dordon Valley than by kayak? That's the ride for the afternoon. <laughs> I think there isn't a better way. You can follow along all these villages and even castles there in the back. It really feels like magic, right? Let's go there now. <laughs> Everyone. Morning. <laughs> Yesterday we made our way inland towards the Dordogne Valley. Yesterday we've been kayaking along the river through all the beautiful villages and even castles. It yes. was really, really magical. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> Merci. Merci. We just got our breakfast, as you can see. <laughs> Other than that, we uh, explored the the very, very like medieval and and, and beautiful villages that are uh, all around here. So. This is one of the main villages called uh, Sarla. Sarla. In the evening, the whole village is lighted with gas lighted lights. Yeah, yeah, in in the authentic lanterns. So you almost get like a Harry Potter vibe in this little town. Yeah, and there was thunder as well last night. So it was <laughs> like super, it, it felt magical. Now it's time. Breaking. 
So for this afternoon, we're going on a Eco Quad bike ride. So these are the bad boys for this afternoon. Look at that. And who's gonna drive? Mew. Yeah. Fully electric. <laughs> And that's the end of the first half of our trip here in France. Yeah, and we spent the last few days in Bordeaux working and resting a little bit. And I got a haircut, Obviously. as you can see. <laughs> um, and now we took the train to a new secret location. It's also here in France, but you have to wait for the next video to see where we are. And if you want to know all the locations and all the tips about this trip, you can head over to saltandair.com slash France. <laughs> right? And then uh, we will see you guys in the next one. Bye! Cause it feels so good, wanna Cause it feels so good